hello and welcome in cad in 360 autocad tutorial videos today in this video we are going to learn how to turn on and off dynamic input in autocad 2024 okay so what is dynamic input uh, dynamic input provides a command interface near the cursor in the drawing area dynamic tooltip provide an alternative way to enter commands when dynamic input is turned on, a tooltip displays dynamically updated information near the cursor. Okay, what information this is giving to us is that uh, since we have uh, active state of uh, dynamic input, uh, we type letter L, which is the shortcut of uh, line command. And now you can see that the command is uh, is appearing near uh, the cursor so this is uh, this is called dynamic input you don't have to write uh, command in command line or command bar uh, this will appear next to the cursor okay now we type the uh, alphabet uh, letter l and and commands related to uh, alphabet l is now appearing uh, besides it uh, line length layer layout line and so on uh, once we place cursor over any any command it is showing its um, information okay so this this way this will enable us to uh, improve our productivity in designing okay we don't have to uh, each and every time uh, uh, go to this command line and then type uh, whatever the command or instruction we want to give to the software so we don't require that by this dynamic input feature okay so uh, how can we uh, turn on and off this feature uh, dynamic input we have a sh shortcut of f12 uh, by pressing f12 we can activate uh, dynamic input on and off we can do it okay another method is uh, in the status bar here you will find uh, dy dynamic input which is now in active state simply click on that and now you can see the, uh, this is turned off uh, and to check it simply type any command now we type uh, letter L and now you can see uh, it is directly uh, directly uh, in uh, directly writing in the uh, command line okay so we have now uh, deactivated uh, the dynamic input to activate this simply click on simply click on this dynamic input okay now once again we type the type letter l now it is in active state so uh, you can observe that by clicking on this uh, uh, button uh, in status bar which is of uh, dynamic input we can enable and disable or we can turn on and off the dynamic input feature of this software if you don't have this uh, uh, button or option in a status bar simply click on this customization option here and here you will find a dynamic input just simply check this uh, option and it will appear anywhere here according to the rest of your selection and then you can enable and disable from here okay and uh, the third method is uh, uh, the command dyn mod then dynamic mode uh, press enter since uh, since we have active state of uh, dynamic input so by default it is placed at 1 if you want to turn it off simply type 0 and then press enter now you can see uh, it is now turned off and you can also check by pressing any command and now you can see uh, uh, the uh, letter is directly directly uh, uh, typing in this uh, command line so we have now uh, turned off uh, dynamic uh, dynamic mode by pressing zero in dynamic mode option command now if you want to activate this simply uh, dynamic mode enter press 1 to activate okay now again type uh, any command let's suppose we are going to type circle for uh, for 
for which uh, c is the shortcut now you can see it is appearing uh, uh, besides the cursor so th these are the methods uh, by which we can turn on and off the dynamic in input feature of this software which is very important software to improve our productivity okay uh, that's all for this video please do like share and subscribe for more video tutorials thank you